Basically, we just got in a car and drove around the block and we had our licence. Yeah. So there was no training programs, no compulsory wearing of seatbelts, and no understanding of alcohol and, um, and, it, and its effect on driving. He had a regional meeting with all the presidents of the local branch YCWs and he was dropping them all off. And it was the last one he was dropping off. Um, Blakefoot went through a red light and smacked his car and this was in the days before seat belts. His door opened and he got thrown out the road and broke his neck was broken. That was the end of him. He was only 23. Um, that was major for me and also major for the white Melbourne YCWs. It was a huge impact. And so when we reflected on uh, uh, Paul's death, um, you know, we talked about our own driving. We discovered that we were drinking and driving. We discovered that our age group were the biggest group of people affected. there were about 11 or 1200 people dying on our roads and we're now down to around 200 yeah and probably the number of cars on the road has increased yeah. tenfold or a hundredfold yeah. the YCW was part of a community campaign a whole host of organizations yeah. got together to say, we need to do something about this. For me, reflecting on it, um, it gave me a real reason to be in the YCW. Yeah. 